Yeah, I think for us to have been a part of designing this display that will ultimately go out to impact 173,000 students yeah. has really been amazing and a unique opportunity. I'm Katie Clark. And I'm Mark Nordby. And we're Nomac Design in Biddeford, Maine. Yeah, I think Maine is a special place for craftsmen and artisans, and it's a deep part of the culture here and that's gone back for generations. And so it feels good to play our part and spend my time building things and working with our hands and being able to have products at the end of the day that we can look at with pride and know that we're contributing to that part of the state's culture. My name is Ryan Cathcart. I'm one of the owners of Orion Woodshop. We're a young woodworking and carpentry business based out of Lisbon Falls, where we're here today. In front of the shop as it stands, we got guys working on uh, the traveling bookcases for I'm Your Neighbor Books. Yeah, so taking the bookshelf from file to delivered final product starts with the collaboration process that we had during the prototype development with IYN and Katie and Mark at Nomac Designs. I would say that this is like a really unique opportunity in the design world, a really gorgeous chance to dig into something with a lot of purpose and meaning. Part of what made this project so interesting and so challenging was that you guys came to us with a lot of constraints, like more than we are used to working with. So it was like, it has to fit inside of a crate. Here's the dimension of the crate. The books had a certain dimension. So the shelves had to end in that, but if we made the pieces too big, then they didn't fit in the crate anymore. So there was like a very fine balance to end up with the size that we had. Could you talk about um, what a CNC machine is and how you designed for a CNC machine? <laughs> so when we were thinking about the design, one thing that's special about it is it can cut a lot of complexity. So that was a great fit for these displays. It was like, what can we do to just have a little bit of fun with it. And that's where we went with the circle. And I remember I was on my phone and opened up Instagram and saw you had posted a little video and the like the face on the cover of the book just like came straight through the circle cut out. And I was like, oh God, it's perfect. <laughs> and this is why I fell in love with the circles. We got the CNC because of the work that we had scheduled with I'm Your Neighbor Books. And from there, it's allowed us to gain efficiencies that we never could have had just with manpower and take on new projects beyond I'm Your Neighbor, doing custom cabinetry in more efficient and effective ways than we ever could have, and growing into full custom kitchens, which it would have been a leap if we didn't have the confidence to add the CNC to our production floor. That wouldn't have been there without I'm Your Neighbor books. Yeah, having the CNC, has been a total game changer for our business. The machine will automatically cut out whatever's been designed out of a sheet of ply or whatever material you wind up putting down on the machine bed. So it can outproduce any human being. It produces a near perfect product every single time. Ultimately, it is able to do what no person could do. And it's been huge for us. Yeah. So. After it comes off the CNC and they go into the next step of the process where these guys are taking them and sanding the edges, running through a spindle sander, orbital sander, and then by knocking edges and grooves by hand and drilling out the holes to kind of clean up the, the frays and everything. So from there, they get brought into the back room and we start to reassemble them make sure the final fitment is working with both the panels coming together and the blocks. We dust them off and pack them away to be sent off to I'm Your Neighbor books. Oh, it's so cool. Like, as a designer, that it's like your baby that you like see out in the world. So anytime anything gets made, it's like very exciting. And then as like I myself was a student of the main school districts, so it, um, is gonna be really cool knowing like, if I were to drive home to VZ and go to the school that I went to, like there's a chance I'll get to see one of these there. So 
it's incredible. It's unlike anything I could have imagined for my design career. You think of designing a home that affects two to six people. You design a, a library that affects thousands of people, but this is 6,100 books going to every school district in the state. And it's, yeah, it's really special. I know several generations ago, my family immigrated here and weren't necessarily met with open arms. So it is nice to know that there are people out there that are putting real efforts into making these kids feel welcomed and being met with compassion and helping understand, you know, this new place they're calling home and having the people that are here understand them a little bit more. And it's a nice thing to be able to participate in.